welcome back to the channel today i have another update video so today's video is going to be about this louis vuitton chain necklace after six months now i know this is a highly requested video there really isn't one on youtube right now and a lot of people wonder if they actually hold up well given the really high retail price so i'm going to be showing you guys an up close look at how these have held up i've had this for a little bit over half a year i got it i believe last november so 2019 november and I've worn it, you know, pretty often, not like casually, like you wear a regular chain just because of how thick it is. So I'll be talking about how to keep it in good condition, what to avoid and, you know, compare it to a regular necklace as well. But overall, this is the Louis Vuitton chain. It's pretty heavy, decent size, you know, really shiny as well. Super, super bright. Of course, this is not an actual gold chain. It is just silver metal. And a lot of people might think it's an actual gold chain because of how shiny it is, but it is just silver metal. But the quality on it is really, really great. And the cuts are beautiful as well. Also in this video, I'll show you guys how this actually looks when you put it on. So it's really easy to put it on and take it off. So basically you have this little closure here, slips right off just like that. Of course, the same way you take it out is how you put it back in, just click. And then once you hear that clasp, it's in. So let me just put on my neck really quick so you guys can see how the sizing is. So here we have the necklace on right now. So this is the basic sizing. It's a little bit shorter than I'd want it to be, but let me put on a regular chain. Now this is a little bit longer than the regular, you know, average chain you'd see. So let me put this on. You guys can see the difference in the sizing and the length. You guys see with the regular chain, the length is definitely a lot more down, but in terms of how wide the chain is, now look how much wider the Louis Vuitton one is than a regular chain that you usually see people wearing in terms of like the quality of it as you guys can see especially with a black shirt really shines really pops out and definitely looks like actual gold show you guys an up close look at this show you guys some of the details and tell you guys how to really maintain this chain once again first thing i want to show is a side by side with the regular average size chain so as you guys can see the difference right there getting into the details of this louis vuitton chain itself so first thing i want to show you guys are these monogram prints that we have speckled throughout the chain they don't really show too much because it is the same color it's just like engraved onto the metal itself let me try to focus it so it shows a little bit better. As you guys can see, I'm gonna go all throughout the chain. There is most of it basically in the middle, but there is some other, you know, speckled in throughout different parts of the chain. Getting into the closure of the chain, here we have Louis Vuitton Paris engraved onto the metal. Right above it, we have an R in a circle. On the back side of the chain, we do have like the Made in Italy logo right there. And then we have some numbers like the serial number and everything written down there. In case you guys want to legit check it, that's how it should look. Let me show you guys this closure system one more time. So you just take it out like this. And then this is how the system is. Very easy to put on and take out. I really like that. The only problem is it is kind of loose. So when you're wearing it, oftentimes this does kind of slip up. It's not going to come out because this ending part is really like you have to actually try to take it out. But this part is pretty loose right here at the beginning. So I just want to talk about the quality of the chain. Overall, again, it's not actual gold, but it is silver colored metal. And, you know, the quality on it is actually really, really nice. Now, of course, for the price they're charging, it definitely has to be. So it's not like your regular like Cuban link that you buy for like, you know, $100 or $200 or whatever. This is actually really good material. So if you guys could look at the cuts up close, like on the corners, it is really, really sharp compared to, you know, regular Cuban links that you see. And that's what gives it like that luxury feel and that luxury design. Is it worth it? I mean, at the end of the day, it's not actual gold. So, you know, the value is not going to go up like gold does but surprisingly these are actually reselling for a few hundred dollars over the retail price and that's because louis vuitton pieces in general are always really limited and this is no different so this did drop one time and then it restocked again last year and i think it restocked one more time but every single time it's sold out almost instantly basically i know a lot of people are worried that because it's metal it's going to go bad pretty soon but i mean after six months you guys could still see it looks basically brand new so one thing you want to do is avoid using any alcohol wipes or any, you know, substances like that to clean this product, like wet wipes that you normally would use to clean products. Do not use it on this. 
when you're putting on cologne or perfume or anything like that make sure to either put it on before you put this chain on like well before it or don't put it on the areas where this chain is going to touch on your neck so just be really careful of that louis vuitton themselves actually recommends you don't do that and that's because it's going to damage the metal and it's going to make it you know lose its color basically and it's going to be discolored all throughout the chain and if you do that it might also leave you know marks on your neck i'm not really sure about that but in terms of the other colors that this comes in of course this is the all silver one there are multicolored chains right now that are still you know being sold um those ones again it's basically made of the same material but these you know metals are just different colors as far as how the coloring of that would hold up i'm really not sure but again i feel like if you just clean it with a cloth you know don't wet it don't put on any substances that you shouldn't be i think they'll stay intact if you haven't had any louis vuitton jewelry in the past then you know the quality on it is really good they last for years trust me if you just take care of it right it's not going to go bad at all if that's your concern or that's what's stopping you from buying it then i would recommend going ahead and picking this up if you just follow the steps that louis vuitton actually provides on how to take care of this material on their website then nothing is going to happen to it um, at least so far in six months nothing has happened to mine of course that may change after a couple of years but at the same time it is a fashion jewelry line you're just buying this you know because it's louis vuitton and wearing it and if it goes bad i mean it goes bad in terms of how heavy it is they are really heavy actually so when you wear it you are going to feel this on your neck the price point again if you have the money or you know you really like the piece go ahead and buy it they do sell out really fast if they do restock and other colors are selling out pretty fast as well. So if you do want one, I would suggest picking it up right away. Don't really hesitate. A lot of Louis Vuitton products sell out really quickly, especially when you hesitate, you wouldn't be able to get it. So yeah, as you guys can see, still stayed really, really shiny. There's literally no differences from when I bought it. Maybe like a couple small scratches here and there, but that's bound to happen. Of course, like little things like this, you just literally rub it away. It goes away, especially with a cloth. It's not a big deal at all. All right, everyone, there we have it. That is the Louis Vuitton chain link patches necklace. Again, this is a silver color with the monogram speckled in throughout it. Of course, there are different colors and each one might hold up differently, but this is specifically for this one. Once again, it has held up really well, in my opinion. I really see no issues with it. Well, I hope you guys found this video helpful. If you did, please that thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more.